We will begin with term definitions to help us understand key gender concepts. What is gender and sex? Now, sex could either be male or female. It is biologically defined as genetically acquired differences between male and females. It defines males and females independently of each other. The definition is universal. What about gender? It is socially defined as culturally learned differences between men or women. It defines men and women with reference to the social cultural relationships between them. Definitions of men and women varies from place to place over time and context. Gender equality is where everyone benefits from the same support. People are treated equally. Gender equity is where individuals are given different supports to participate equally. They are being treated equitably. Gender liberation is where inequity is addressed and all systemic barriers are removed and everyone is now involved. Gender blind ignores or fails to address the gender dimensions in any given project or research. It ignores gender biases that exist in society. It usually uses gender blind terms, which may result in girls and women and boys and men becoming invisible. Gender neutral is when gender is not considered relevant to developmental outcomes. Gender norms, roles and relations are not affected by the technology or change. Gender sensitive is the ability to acknowledge gender differences and to develop strategies to address gender norms, roles and access to resources so far as it is needed to reach project goals. Gender mainstreaming is a strategy for making women as well as men's concerns and experiences an integral dimension of the design, implementation, monitoring and evaluation of policies and programs in all political, economical and societal spheres so that women and men both benefit equally. The ultimate goal is to achieve equality. Gender responsiveness is where outcomes can be achieved by ensuring both men and women are included equitably in the activities of the research program. Women's and men's empowerment refers to men and women taking control of their lives, setting their own agendas, gaining skills, increasing self-confidence, solving problems and developing self-reliance. Sex desegregated data is any data that is cross-classified by sex that is presented separately for both women and men, girls and boys, and that takes into account women's and men's roles, realities, conditions and situations. Intersectionality is the acknowledgement that everyone has their own unique experiences which marginalize them, that is gender, sex, class, geographical area, ethnicity, wealth and social relations.